Hey guys, how's it going? Toby here. Welcome back to a brand new video here on my channel. Welcome to a little squad. But since I did get the inform Benteke yesterday in a pack, and I thought I might as well make a squad around him to see if he's any good. I'll let you guys know what I thought about the team. So I made a team around him and the inform Origi as well. He has got a inform recently. I thought he looks pretty good because he's got a position change to striker. And his stats look absolutely insane. So I thought I'd try those two out and make a decent team around them. I also want to try out Cavani at centre attacking mid. Because someone recommended me it and it looks pretty cool. So I'm going to try that out as well. Now, if you do want to get some coins, check the link in the description for the FIFA shop.co.uk. They are still operating and they do have three really awesome ways for you guys to get coins into your account. Which is excellent. And if you want to get some MFP, PSN codes or even just some really, really cheap games, check the link to G2A in the description as well. And use the code tby3 to get an extra three percent off your entire order which is really cool so let's have a talk about this team and why i picked some players and who we've got in the team now i do want to mention i do really need to mention this because casillas was mind-blowingly terrible in this team i've used him before i've used him a lot before and before he's been really good he's been really solid very consistent does the job nicely in this team my word, he was a shambles. An absolute shambles. He was so bad, I don't even know. Like, I don't remember him actually saving anything. So, once I played, I think I played like four games and I was like, right, this is it. This is, I've had enough of, I've had enough of Casillas. And then from that point on, I played like three extra games with Courtois in goal. And I didn't have any of the troubles that I did with, with Casillas in goal. It was so much better. So, I don't really know what to do because you need Casillas in goal to get the chemistry with Verane, but there's a way you guys can get around it and not have Casillas in goal. I would, I would recommend you, you don't have him. Maybe he'll be okay for you, but for me, in this team specifically, he did really bad. But then again, beforehand, he was actually pretty good for me. So, we've got the Betsy, we've got Matuidi, two very, very good PSG players, and they just, they do the job nicely. They really do. And then on the right-hand side, we're going to go with Morales to link up nicely with our... Green Coleman, obviously, it doesn't matter if you don't have the Green Coleman, just use the normal one. And, you know, it's exactly the same card. I just thought I might as well since I have him. Morales is a very, very good player for me. He's nicely well-rounded and got decent shooting, great passing, and a lot of pace. Also, that high attacking work rate is always really good as well. So, we're going to throw in Cavani at centre attack in mid. And whilst I don't think he did bad, it didn't really do anything outstanding for me. His finishing wasn't actually incredible, which is... Actually, the bit that I was really looking forward to, because I've played against Cavani so many times, and he's been brutal to me, and I don't know why mine didn't do the job. Probably because he was at centre attack mid, but that shouldn't really matter. Like, long shots, he didn't really have any at all. Origi is going to be the striker on the left-hand side. 86 pace, 77 shooting, 6 foot 1, and a high attacking work rate. Like, for 19k, that looks like a phenomenal win form. Like, an absolutely incredible card. And I'll tell you what I thought about him once we get in some gameplay. Link up on the other side, it's going to be Benteke. Got him in a pack, but I think he's like 120k maybe. 6 foot 3, medium, medium work rate, 81 pace, 84 shooting, and 88 physical. Also, I believe he's got like 95 strength, which is just mental. Crazy, crazy high strength. And that is the team. It's what looks like a really solid team on paper. Like, you've got a good defense, you've got a good midfield, you've got a great attack, really strong, really bulky, very tall. It looks like it's got a lot of options, and it's in a very, very competitive formation. The problem is, I really, really didn't like it. In fact, I'd say this is probably one of my most least liked teams I've ever used. I really, really didn't like it, and I don't know. Origi is possibly <laughs> one of the worst strikers I've used in terms of finishing. He could not get the ball in the back of the net to save his life. His pace is quite nice. He hasn't got the worst strength. He did feel pretty nice when dribbling, but he literally hit the bar countless times, smacked it over countless times. I I don't even know. Like, I really wanted this team to be good because I was so excited about using Benteke. I was so excited about using Origi and Cavani at centre attack and mid. I wanted this team to be so, so good, but I'm not going to lie to you guys. It was rubbish. I, I mean, I, I scored goals. I still won some games, but I really, really had to... Probably put in some effort to get some goals. They just weren't attacking. They weren't. They weren't putting the ball in the back of the net. And like I said, players kept missing 
some very, very easy finishes, especially, especially Origi. My word. I mean, maybe I was just unlucky. I will, I will have some of the blame. Like, I was playing pretty bad today. So I will take some of the blame. I don't think it's the worst team ever. I really don't. But I don't think it's good. Like, I, I don't think it's competitive compared to some of the others that I've used. And for the value that you pay for it. Like, 200k, you expect to have a really, really solid team. And you can make an amazing team for that amount of money. So I'm giving it a 6. And that might seem really low. Because I usually give quite high ratings. Mainly because I try and really make just good teams. But I did want to just be completely honest with you. It's a really cool team on paper. But for me, personally, it did not work at all. Like, it just felt a bit too... Like, no one really moved. It was, it was weird. But if you want to try it out, feel free. I wouldn't recommend it personally, but that's just based on my personal preference. And I hope you have enjoyed today's video. Thank you very much for watching, guys. Take care. Have an amazing day, and goodbye.